Hi, I'm Stuart Agnew, and uh, today we're going to have a look at uh, the waterfall range of pumps, a uh, three-year warranty on the waterfall range, and we're going to have a look at flow and head out. What does that mean if you're just picking a pump? How do you do that, and what's the best pump for you to give you the best um, effect on your water feature? What I've got here is I've just got one of the boxes. It's a waterfall 700 with a standard cable. You do get an extra length cable for uh, obviously a water feature that's um, uh, bigger or deeper than some of the others. But on the box, you'll see that it has a uh, 700 means 700 liters per hour. That's its pump range at zero height. That means if that is the maximum it'll pump without any height attached to it. And then it's got a maximum head height. The 700 has got a maximum head height of 1.2 meters. And maximum head height means the height maximum that the water will push uh, before it stops. So it'll be in a pipe and it'll get up to 1.2 meters. But obviously, if you've got a water feature of 1.2, you'll have no flow. So the uh, the rule of thumb is this, if you're wanting to see what's the best pump, if you've got a one meter feature, then take double that, so a two meter pump. So if I have a look on my um, uh, box, a two meter pump will be, I think a 1500, a waterfall 1500 will be the ideal uh, pump because it has an ideal range of operation. So obviously the higher the, the water feature is, the, the uh, water flow comes down. Uh, there are some anomalies. If you've got a circular uh, water feature and the water flows over the whole um, water feature, that obviously has an effect on your water flow. So those little things you must just take into account when you doing a head out for your pump there we go you can see the water coming up and it shoots up to 2.3 meters that's this waterfall 2400 so 2.3 is maximum head out it'll hold it there but it won't come out the um, the pipe that is what head out max means so we'll see how to choose the correct height or the correct pump depending on the height of your water feature Remember the, the key things is this, twice the height of what you need. So if it's a one meter water feature, you want to go twice the height is the ideal. Uh, take into account if it's a circular uh, water flow, maybe a pot that the water is going to br brim over, that's going to change the flow because uh, if you have a just a little spout, a wide spout, those all affect uh, your water flow. So if you really want a good flow, a real strong flow, just make sure that you're getting the right uh, pump. And as you saw in the demonstration, maximum head height, uh, you do want to get a maximum head height uh, for your water feature. You want to go at least half of that and that will actually give you the best use of your water feature. 